the network. Beats. He said, Sean always keeping it real. Appreciate that. I try. He said, the 666 days single release plan some are advising and promoting might also just be a way for these people to gain a lot of watch time on their YouTube channels. I ain't never heard of that, bro. I ain't know people were doing stuff like that, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, people are definitely going to do things to get attention, naming it, something like that. Um, if you get used so much, man, I don't, it's, it's crazy. But um, yeah, I'll say this, man. When it comes to listening to advice on these pages, a platform like YouTube is all about watch time, right? So a lot of these people, um, there are a lot of people that I know who are giving advice opportunistically because they can get paid off of YouTube specifically and they're not actually doing this marketing stuff for real, right? Or they're not finding great success as an artist. So let me give a little information and say one thing that works that ha that I've that I've done and hopefully get more more views right that can make me more money off of my YouTube than I ever made off of my music all right there, there's a lot of motives because marketing is such a hot topic and it's easy to get people to listen at this time it is people are, people want to know how to grow right so everybody wants to become a marketer and give marketing advice because they can get views and try to get money off of those views or try to build a fan base off of those views it's a very real thing so understanding that it's an opportunistic moment in time in this space particularly around the subject of marketing know that you know see if what people are saying checks out uh, see if they're doing it are they practitioners even an artist who does it themselves like they're doing it for themselves that can be meaningful right it means okay he at least did it for himself and it worked for himself however just because somebody shows you inside a facebook ad platform while they do it or a youtube ad platform or something like that doesn't mean that they really know what they're doing they might literally just know how to tell how to get here i moved to a new city and i have to go to work just because i know how to go to work does that mean i know my way around the city yet i might not right so don't even look at that as something that gives somebody authority in the space. Now, if it worked for them or they did one thing that worked, it means it could work for you, right? But it doesn't mean it will work for you. That's why this marketing thing is about finding your path, finding your journey, right? That's custom to you and building from there, right? And each path has its own levers to pull. Each path has, has things that have to happen in a certain sequence. Right. So you mess around, take some some advice from somebody else's path that might not be applying to your path at all. Or it might be step five instead of step two on your particular path. That's how artists, you know, run in circles or run into brick walls and get frustrated and maybe lose money until the point that they don't have any money to invest. Right. <laughs> and they and they give up. Right. Like I've seen it time and time again. So, yes, pay a lot of attention. Appreciate you saying that again, you drunk beats, but pay a lot of attention. Two, who you're getting this advice to. Man, my my, my, my girl's crying over there. Hopefully y'all can't hear it. But 